Greetings all and welcome back to the channel. And welcome to the tiny little hamlet of Admiral Saskatchewan. Well, it's, I don't know if it's a hamlet or if it's a small village, but uh, we're here. And as you can see, we got a grain elevator over there. I've got lightning at that grain elevator already. I picked it up in about 2013 or so. So a long time ago, but uh, before we get to uh, exploring this little town, I'll draw your attention to those clouds up there. That's exactly what I'm waiting for for tonight for lightning. So I don't know if I'll be here or if I'll be in Cadillac, which is just to the east of here. But I'll be somewhere, I'll tell you what. I'm going to try as hard as I can to get lightning in Cadillac. But if I can't do it there, just based on where these clouds are, I can get it right here just fine. And since my earlier shots from 13 are we're using the D8 or the D5100 and I didn't have my full frame back then, I'm kind of thinking I wouldn't have a problem shooting here again. And as you're about to see, this is one seriously nice town. I love it here. I would live here. But uh, we got to go check out the town. Let's do that. There is not much of a downtown left. I think it's even smaller than Cadillac and Neville. Maybe 60, 70 people live here. And I would very much have no problems making myself one of those residents if I had to move somewhere. There's the old co-op there. That would have been a grocery store plus liquor store. Obviously long closed. Welding and repair. Probably not still in business, I'm thinking. But they could be, you never know. Got somebody picking up their mail up there. God, I love this town. Another long closed business over here. And you can see the two of the three churches over there. We'll get to those soon enough. We'll see those with the drone. There's the community hall right there. Happy Hearts Club. And up yonder there is a school, but uh, that school is long closed and privately owned, so don't bother, someone lives there, I do believe. That little red building is the post office. Brick building is an old bank, I think, but now a private residence. Oh, what's been built here? There's your three churches that are in town. There used to be a fourth one. It was right about over there. But it got moved out of town maybe 20, 30 years ago, and I just drove past it earlier today. It's still there. So we've still got four Admiral Churches still in existence. Love it. I gotta check this out. I've never seen this before. I'm still finding new stuff. Been to this town like three or four times and I'm still finding new stuff. I do not know what this is, but I have a feeling it has something to do with spraying or something, possibly firefighting. I don't know. And there's another look at the school over there. Private property, don't bother them. But yeah, you know what I'm thinking? If I'm here for lightning, yield. Anyway, if I'm here for lightning, what I could do, if those clouds are where the later clouds are expected to be, 
and I kind of expecting am expecting that. I could shoot that way and get some epic lightning from this angle, maybe. I don't know, maybe not. You can't see over the horizon here. In 13, I got one of my best lightning shots ever at that church straight ahead. That's the Lutheran Church. I'll show it to you if I can find it, but uh, for now, I'm going to wander back to the car, and I think I'm probably going to go up to the church, get some drone footage over at the churches, and uh, probably I'll camp out here for a little while till I know what the storms are going to do. Then I'll make the call as to whether or not I'm going to uh, Cadillac or staying right here in Admiral or going somewhere else. Like I said in numerous videos in the past, I gotta go where the lightning is. I got distant lightning for the very first video of the season and uh, I'm not taking that for for an answer. I need the close-up lightning now. Those are the money shots. And look at that cloud. It's building up pretty good, isn't it? And actually, so is that one over there. But yeah, we've actually got a tornado warning in the province now. Not anywhere near here, mind you. Because uh, you've heard of the tornado hunter? Well, I'm the tornado killer. They just don't happen where I am. <laughs> Ever. One of these days, maybe it'll happen for me, but uh, it's not going to be today. I'm sure of it. Because the tornado warning we got now is up by Saskatoon. We do have some severe warnings around here, including the storm I was just shooting from Cadillac doing this uh, segment of the uh, Cadillac video, the walk around. That one is severe warned. It took Environment Canada a while to uh, severe warn it. It was warned in the United States, but then it kind of crossed the border and, and just didn't do it. But uh, you can still see it from here. It's right straight that way beyond this big puffy cloud you see here. All right, folks, I'll show you the churches here. This would be the Lutheran Church here in Admiral. I'm gonna pan across the, uh, the stormy plains, as it were. Well, it's not stormy yet, but it will be. At least I hope it will be. And that one right there, well, actually, I'll show them both at the same time. There's two churches here. The one on the left is the Catholic Church that is still in use. And the one on the right is the United Church, which is a private residence now. So, uh, yeah, again, don't bother them. It's a house. But uh, since it's a United Church, it's very nice to see that it's still there. So we'll go over and shoot the elevator real quick. I've got 70% battery. Why is the drone in normal mode? I've got s cine mode selected. Methinks DJI has some bugs to work out with this drone. Oh well, what are you going to do? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to drone the elevator. Because I've never done that here. And I might do it again later with the uh, Light Plus. Okay, there's our elevator. Once again, shooting an ND32 on the drone. 
And I'm glad it hasn't messed up yet again, like it did with uh, the Neville shots. Nice big orange elevator. Shonovan used to have one like that. Hasn't been there for a long time though. If you've been there or if you know the Shonovan area, the big orange grain elevator used to be near the two that are still there, but it's where that strip mall is with the subway. That's where it used to be. Okay, we can just about see the whole town from this angle, so let me go up a little. And I'm currently parked over by the Lutheran Church, so that's where you, you're you going to find me in the shot if you can see me. And yeah, that's the whole town. Used to be much bigger, of course, but uh, that's the way it is these days. And in case you're wondering, yes, you can get high-speed internet here. Sastel does offer that here. Alright, so since this is the last planned shot I've got for uh, for the Mini 3 Pro, let me aim it towards those storms that are forming and have formed. And we'll take a look at those and I will... Let's see, we're at 55 meters. Let's max out the height on the drone. We'll go up to the full legally permitted limit. Clouds looking real healthy. No blurred edges on the top. It's still going to build some more, I think. Max altitude reached. And there we go, max altitude. So that's our cloud. I'm going to bring her around again and we'll take one more look at the town. So there it is folks, Admiral Saskatchewan. Okay, folks, so it's about six o'clock in the evening now. I'm still an admiral, and uh, I've been watching the forecast models for the last couple hours, and uh, unfortunately it looks like this is going to be one of those bust days that we storm chasers get every now and then. The forecast models are no longer looking very good for after dark lightning anywhere around here, so I'm still going to sit tight and see what happens because I'm already out here. I've already spent the gas money and uh, I've already done all this shooting and stuff, but uh, it looks like this is probably going to be the last video in the series of three. So yeah, it is what it is. You accept this if you're getting into storm chasing, but uh, I'm not giving up yet. I'm still going to probably get some uh, sunset shots with the churches and or the elevator. So at least I'll get something more here. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.